and welcome back to Plans on Planning. As you can see, we are here in my personal planner and we are starting off a wonderful month, the new month of June. So that means we're going to get done um, with our monthly spend during this series of videos and I cannot wait to get started. Now, as you can see, I have a little sticker here and that's just because I had something planned ahead of time and because my monthly spread wasn't done, I couldn't officially write it in. So I just get my little flags and I write down to remind me of what's gonna happen for the upcoming month or even sometimes the upcoming week before I get my spreads done. The best part about it though is, granted this says June 4th to the 8th, but that has actually changed now that the trip is finalized and we've moved it a week um, to the 11th. So that gives me added bonus for using these flags because even if I wasn't caring about monthly spreads and things like that, had I already written this in like on the actual planner, I'd be kind of screwed right now and having to find like some really great washi and then some stickers to cover it up and all that wonderful stuff. So that is why I use my flags. Anything that is like never set in stone, I always use my flags to write them down. And then once I get all like the finalized details and things like that, then I'll write it down with like pen or maybe even pencil. I should probably start with pencil even when it's finalized, because things change even when they're finalized. But nonetheless, it's finalized now. We're in this wonderful um, monthly spread. So let's get planning. All right, so first we're gonna get rid of my little sticker. Um, I got my white out, so we're gonna get rid of this June. I know it's nothing against June personally, but we've got some plans for this area. I got a lot of plans for this area because truthfully, I'm doing something very, very different this month in this um, series of my videos. We have washi to work with. And as you can see, I have a lot of washi to work with. I have wide washi to work with. Very, very wide washi to work with, to be honest with you. And I have two of them that are super wide. Now, the thing is, um, I wanted to do something different, like I started saying, but... This first week right here, well, a good portion of this first week doesn't even belong to June. So I figured why not cover it up with some washi. So I'm going to use this as my banner washi, this as some really cute washi to go over this area. Um, I have this to frame out my weeks. And then because I covered up my Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we had to replace it with something, correct? So I found some washi that actually says Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, blah, blah, blah. You get the deal. And it's really pretty because it's in gold. So we're getting rid of it all. Everything has to go. So just to make it super easy on myself and making sure nothing shows through the washi, we're getting rid of just about everything. Ha ha ha. Like I said, it's nothing personal. I'm just gonna knock out these dates. And let's see what happens. All right. So that's completely covered. All right, let's uh, let's get this baby going. So I have this lovely washi here that I absolutely love. As you know, I went on a little binge with floral washi. I'm just like really into that right now. So to make it super easy on myself, I'm not going to really try to line it up. I'm just using the top of the page as my guide going across and got my wonderful bringing it as close to the rings as possible and then I tear now for this side I am going to like start it bringing it all the way to the rings and I'm not gonna hold it down all the way, just in case. 
I get some ripples. All right, there we go. So um, I want to still keep my little calendar there. So I'm lining it up with the edge. And then we're going to tear. Bam. Oops. Now I have my other washi to use, which comes in right under it. Follows in on the theme. This one says beautiful and welcome to my garden. Always be lovely. Because I thought that was really cute. Okay. Just want to make sure everything's sticking. And I'm using that to cover this first week. And then I have a sticker that I'm going to put here. Yes, yeah, so I took time to actually plan it out this time around. As opposed to just winging it. Like I said, I'm trying something different. Now, because this washi goes a specific way, I'm going to turn my book around just to make it easier on myself. I don't need the added pressure. And I'm going to line it up right with the bottom of the washi that I already have there. So I'm not going to stick it, stick it all the way. I'm going to line first. Bringing it as close, oh gosh, as close to the edge as possible. There we go. All right, and then I'm going out with it. Ha ha ha. Look at that. Super freaking cute. And I'm taking this all the way to the edge of the page, just like my other washi. And, oh gosh, and tearing it. Okay, straight lines though. Straight lines, straight lines. There we go. So I thought that was super cute. Let me cut this off. Bam. And there we have it. Here is the start of our planner for the month of June. I think it's really cute. So now, my washi to frame out, this is going to be it. I'm gonna frame out my weeks with this washi. And I am going to put it, like it has enough space, so I am going to put it right at the top, and then I'm gonna go each week. And I'm gonna put a little bit up here as well. And if I could find the beginning. Now, to find the beginning, I just run my finger across it, and I look for the non-smoothness. Bam, here we go. Ah, I thought I had it. Whew. All right. Someone, she just doesn't want to work with me. Like, what's that about? Okay, awesome. So, now, it's floral. I can have it go any way I want. I'm going to do it my way. Now, this washi doesn't necessarily fit up the whole area. So, I'm going to kind of keep it in the middle. Just like that. Haha. -ha. And I'm taking it to the edge. And cutting it and that's how we're gonna do it oh my gosh it's so freaking cute all right I'm going right above the numbers and I'm just going little by little just to make sure it's sticking Little by little. Yeah, I'm really liking the way this came out. Okay, don't forget that the 17th is Father's Day. The 21st is the first day of summer. So I actually found a really cute little sticker. 
to celebrate that or to remind myself of that. And then I have birthdays. It's actually a really big birthday. No, it's not mine. My birthday's August. Don't forget. If you do, I will hold it against you. It's my dad's birthday this month. So, of course, we got to do something for that. Alright, and I'm going to go right up the side, which overlaps just a tad. Like I said, I just like to go little by little just to make sure that it actually sticks. Bam. Right. Look how cute that is. Now, I truthfully can go right here. Let me try that. I feel like I'm doing the most right now, but hey, it's my planner. <laughs> Let me be honest. What I'm doing right now is nothing <laughs> close to easy. Like, it is basically just enough space. And I have no idea. Oh, I have scissors. I'm like, how am I going to cut it with my scissors, silly? Yeah, because there was no way I could break that. All right, fabulous. Oh, my gosh, it's so cute. It absorbs. I love it. I totally, totally love it. All right, on to the next side. So we're going to put this right here. And, oh, gosh, I missed it. All right, so... I'm actually going to hold it because, all right, yeah, there we go. And I'm bringing it right to the edge. Bam. And I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going right above the numbers. Right above the numbers. Bam. All right, all right, all right. Okay, last but certainly not least for going across and I'm using the bottom of the page as my guide and then we're going to go down the sides this one's kind of hard because it's coming off the edge all right here we go down the sides now I'm leaving space so I can still see my calendar And then here we go down this side. And like I said, it is truly just enough space. It was a little crooked. There we go. Much, much better. And then we cut. And then everything is fabulous. And beautiful and I'm totally 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 in love all right now it's time to add some stickers in oh we have to do our do we want to sully this with like a Monday Tuesday Wednesday Urgh. I mean I have it but I actually don't want to use it now because it kind of seems like it would get in the way because I mean should I put it Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then Thursday, Friday, Saturday? But I actually kind of like it without. I don't know. Let's see. One for a practice run. Alrighty. 
let's do a practice room let's see what it looks like so because because it's starting off funky anyway let's see what it looks like oh, i need a monday all right so i'm just cutting out the whole week that i need So we have so this is Sunday. This is Monday. You can't really tell to be honest. Saturday. I guess it's kind of like no harm, no foul. Friday. Thursday. Wednesday and Tuesday. And last but certainly not least, Tuesday. Okay, it's like, would wait until I get to the last one to act. Oh, super weird. <laughs> Why won't this Tuesday cooperate? Okay, there we go. Tuesday. Tuesday. All right, it's not bad. Like I said, no harm, no foul. It's not bad at all. Oh, it's kind of cute. All right. Just reinforcing the stick. Okay, so let's get some... Pictures going. All right, so let's do a little celebration. We have Father's, I mean, yes, Father's Day, first day of spring, my dad's birthday. Father's Day, first day of spring. Oh gosh, should I lose the first day of spring sticker? And for those stickers, sorry about it. I have my happy memory keeping dates and holidays. I know it's in here. I saw it already. I probably should have. Oh, here we go. First day of spring. Bam. First day of spring is the 21st. All right. And my dad's birthday is the 20th can't forget that otherwise I'd be in some serious trouble all right so for that okay so what I did remember I told you I actually came with a plan this time around since doing my gratitude planner and it was kind of really boring I've been putting much much effort in to come with some type of actual plan some type of actual idea of what I want to do themed or whatever so what I did was, because you know I have a ton of stickers. So what I did was go through all my sticker books and wherever I saw a sticker I wanted, I just paper clipped it. So this one, I have weekend banners that I want to use in one of my planners. So I put a paper clip on it. This one, I had the happy birthday stuff that I'm going to use for my dad's birthday. So I put a paper clip on it. And that's how I'm staying organized. So I wanted to do a party and a woohoo. Here we go. Here's a blue party. Oh, I should write, should I write in dad's birthday? Hmm, 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 hmm. Yeah, let me write that in before I start putting stickers all over the place. Alrighty. Um, yeah, I'm realizing I'm making scuff marks with my nails. I should probably be a little more careful. Um, so, uh, da, da, da. let's do this color. Dad's birthday. I was gonna put dad. 
BJ. I'm a little funky. Alright. Put those to the side. Alright, let's do. I wanted to do a party and a woohoo. So we got party. Get woohoo. <laughs> all right there we go that's in celebration of my dad's birthday um this week i have a business trip so i got my markers i got me some dual tip markers um straight from target very inexpensive similar to the tombos but without tombow prices i'm going to write in business tri business trip because i'm going to be gone from the 11th to the well actually i'm going to be gone from the 10th to the 15th to be honest um what color matches what we're doing here? How about this green? No, this one. I'm going to do it with the pretty side. Uh, I'm going to do it here and then here. I have a flight. Oh, gosh. I'm supposed to paper clip everything off, being an adult. What I do with the flight one. I had one that says flight. I promise I did. I promise. Promise, promise, promise. Was it in here? No. Oh, I think it was this one. All right. I have something that says something about flight somewhere. Even though it doesn't seem like it at this point. I really feel like it's in front of my face, but I'm overlooking it. That's fine, though. Anyway, that's our business trip. Business trip. Ha uh ha. -huh. Alrighty, um, let's get some more stickers going. Alright, so, I have my weekend stickers that I want to use, because there's nothing better than some weekend love. Ah, oh, look at the fight, I told you I had the fight stuff. I had the two pages that I wanted to use paperclip together. Duh. All right, so we're gonna do a little, no, 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 no. Hello, weekend. And I have this one here. That isn't working with me. For what reason I have not the slightest of ideas. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that one's really stuck in. Alright. Bam. Weekend. I don't know, my dad's birthday's in the middle of the week, but maybe we can still take a flight up. Hmm. And then I can be like the super best daughter ever. Hello. Alright, so because I'm leaving, I think I'm gonna do here to make sure we have our packing list together for our trip. And then I'm gonna use my pretty pretty destination stickers here and my return flight here. I think I have a build through here. So let me do it like this. Oh, which reminds me, let's add some bills to this before we get too carried away with fun stickers. Yeah, let's do that. So I have these super cute 
bill um little stickers that say bill on them and then i write the bill in um from the zany palette and i used them last month and totally 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 loved them so of course we're using them again this month all right so what's doing the first of the month but stinking rent oh this is the first of the month <laughs> actually is there enough space not really okay so right under the number the bill i have that I have my Comcast is due, my cable. Um, yeah, I have a bill due here. I do know that, but I'm gonna put it on the seventh. This there's a credit card bill that's due on the eighth. Um, then I have student loans due on the 15th told you I knew I had something due I just realized I have a bill that's due here so we're gonna move this can't get so fancy add that bill here for the 10th alrighty um I got the electric bill due on the 16th. Should I be writing these in as I put them down? Let's do that. I think I want to write them in, in green. So we have rent and cable. Uh, this is a credit card. This is a credit card. This is my student loan. This is the electric. Then we have car insurance and, and the car payment, duh. I'm like, hmm, what could I be missing? The actual car payment, silly girl. All right, so car insurance is always due at the end of the month. I mean, the car payment is due at the end of the month. The car insurance is due about the 24th. There we go, 24th. Okay. So this is Allstate. And this is the car payment. All right. Ha ha ha. Bills all done. You know, I have to use my awesome fine liners. All right, let's get some more stickers popping. Now that we've done all the adulting, which I'm very glad that that's over and done with, let's get some stickers going. Okay, this isn't the book I wanted. No. Yeah. But I kind of like this one. Your vibe attracts your tribe. And it works for the colors that we're using. So I'm actually going to put that right in here. Your vibe attracts your tribe. I love it. Oh, now back to the stickers that I actually wanted to use. Okay, I promise you I did have a, oh gosh, I have a plan. I had a sticker that I wanted to use here. Here we go. Stay curious. I wanted to put that here. Just over, actually, put it in the whole thing. Bam. Stay curious. And then, I love this one. It goes in right here well it covers my thursday all right so let's can i pop thursday up actually i can cut it do if we just cut off the top bam 
ha ha ha. And I bring it down just a tad. Did I miss a piece? There we go. All right. I wanna cover basically the whole square. Okay, that didn't quite work, but nonetheless, there we go. All right. All right. Okay. And I think I wanna put, we have some something thin. There's a happy, 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 which I think is super cute there, but I'm going to see if there's something else. Happy, happy, happy is basically what I'm going for, to be honest. Okay. Yeah. I think this is going to be awesome. Alright, okay, let me see if I can find something here. The only thing that I don't like about these is that they're really narrow. So it's rather difficult to find something that fits. Oh, this. This is what I wanted to use, but didn't necessarily have enough space. But it's actually nice and narrow and will fit right here. It says, all you need is faith, trust, and a little bit of pixie dust. <laughs> All right. So, here is the start to my month for um, June. I think it's pretty freaking awesome. I think we're off to a really, really good start. And I can't wait to see what this month brings. I thank you guys ever so very much for hanging out with me and doing all of this and creating and collabing. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, you can leave a message right under this video. Or you can go ahead and send me an email if you're more comfortable with that. Don't forget to follow me on social media and then send me a DM and let me know, like, hey, I saw your video. And you can ask me any questions in my DMs as well. Um, I definitely hit you back there, too. But until next time, I'll see you guys.